So, Pastor Autry, can I call you Terrence? Yes, Lisa, since I've been your husband for the last 35 years, I think you've oh. earned the right to call me Terrence. Thank you. <laughs> I have a question for you that I know a lot of people at Christ Community and in our community are asking, why would I get up and go to a marriage conference at a church on a Saturday? That's a great question because I know I got a lot of things I want to do on Saturday morning. Absolutely. And it's got to be a really good, compelling reason to want to come out on a Saturday morning. Well, I can think of a number of things. First of all, number one, everybody needs a tune up. You just can't let your relationships run on autopilot. You got to make sure everything's working fine. Number two, you need to meet other couples because there's so many challenges that families and marriages go through. You need to know you're not the only one in the boat. And it's just good to know and connect with other people, other couples, other marriages to say, hey, you know what? We have similar challenges. And then number three, the big one, we're just going to have some big time fun. Oh, the stop, prizes, stop, stop, the... stop, stop, stop. You went too far. No, we're going to have fun in church. At church. We gonna have fun a, at church. We're going to have a marriage party on Saturday morning. Be there. <laughs> okay, but... What if I'm not married? What if I'm seriously dating? Why would I come? Because then you can really see and learn and get the foundation for a relationship. One of the mistakes a lot of couples make, they think, hey, I'll just learn on the fly. But would you want somebody to learn to fly a plane on the fly? No, you want them to learn from somebody that's experienced. And so you got other couples who've been there. You can learn from them. You can learn from other people. You can get your foundation right so that everything is smooth sailing. Okay, but people are going to get in my business. No, it's not yes. about that. No, it's not about that. We, it's, the conference is set up in such a way we're not trying to share business. We're simply trying to share the truth, information that can help you do well in life. That's the goal. That's what we do. And we develop friendships and we connect with other people in the process and just have a great time. And actually, for real, we have been married 35 years, but just like anybody else, it goes up and down. Yes. Everybody has challenges. Everybody has challenges. And a lot of times we think we're the only ones. So there's two things I think about along the lines of what you said. If your marriage is going well, well, if you love to cook, don't you take care with what you cook? If you like to dress, if you like your hair, you do your nails, whatever, women, you take care with your appearance, whatever it is. If you like sports, if you like cars, whatever it is that you really care about, your kids, you spend time with it. But unfortunately, a lot of times when our marriages are going well or pretty well, we just really kind of, you said it, put it on autopilot and that's not good. And then, stop, if our <laughs> marriages aren't going well, if we're in that challenge season, then we feel shame. We think we're the only ones and right. we think, okay, we're headed to divorce. You don't need to be. So all of us go through challenges. All of us can learn from one another. And one of the best things I found out in marriage conferences is we're not alone and we're going through the same thing. Very similar. Everything she said plus 10. I agree 100%. Well said, Lisa. Thank you. Well said, Pastor Autry. May I call you Terrence? You can call me Terrence. You don't have to keep calling me Pastor. So shy. Just on the camera, though. When we get off the camera, back to Pastor Autry. Dr. Autry. <laughs> Listen, it's free. We have a tremendous couples ministry led by Anthony Lorraine Potts. Um, they have a phenomenal team. It's a great time together. Let's grow together. Did I say it's free? And childcare is provided, but you have to pre-register. You have to pre-register. And do it by, please, June 13th. So we will see you Saturday, June 15th at Christ Community. It's casual dress. Friends are welcome. Just be there. Be there. <laughs>